Get a pistol, it is. No scope. Sick. Sick. Uh, let's go back. Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy NWP and today we're going to be talking about the patch 4.0 in Fortnite Battle Royale. But before we get started with that today, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, take the time right now to subscribe to the channel because we have a thousand uh, subscriber giveaway going on for when we hit 1000 subscribers and we're going to be giving away 25 V-Bucks to two different people and uh, yeah, you got to be subscribed. That's like the basic absolute thing to get into this so if you want to get some free v bucks go ahead and go and subscribe to the channel and hit the link right below for your uh ability to get a few more entries if you'd like and uh yeah for you know as long as i can get people subscribing and watching i'm going to try and do more giveaways and build up the youtube so that i can uh you know give back to the community that is giving to me basically so anyways guys as you can see by the beginning of the video i destroyed dr lupo and this is basically more of a talk about how console players actually can and should be less intimidated to play cross-platform against pc players i'm actually on the console playing against a pc player i'm not on pc with a controller at, at this time and as you can see i just destroyed him with a headshot i mean you, if you watch carefully if you go back through you'll notice that i actually run underneath the, the bridge and up the stairs and headshot him as a retaliation for killing ty but if you guys would love to check out any of the ty's live streams uh you can go to twitch.tv slash b-o-o-t-i-f-u-l yeah beautiful and uh check her out and uh throw her a uh follow and uh subscribe if you're uh and so inclined if you like the content but you know it it becomes a thing here the rigidity of the game uh well gaming world i should say is that the pc master race has all the advantages mouse and keyboard is superior to controller uh the graphics are superior to console and you know so on and so forth blah 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 blah. we could come up with a thousand different things you've heard before but is it true is it true well they actually stressed this uh test heavily with titanfall and the game battles where they had the top uh, pc team play against the top xbox team in a 1v1 match uh titanfall uh you know competitive rules and the pc team did win but they did not win by a margin that was so large that you could say that it was the mouse and keyboard you could literally just say that they put in that little bit of extra effort at the end of the match so when interviewed they later said that this was one of the toughest matches they had ever played and that they can see certain things you know there's certain key elements of gameplay where you're not going to uh, excel with the uh, controller, per se. And that is really something we can point out in Fortnite, okay? So, with a mouse and keyboard in Fortnite, precision building for an advanced run where you're going to, like, build stairs and uh, walls in front of it is going to be way simpler, and it's going to be even uh, potentially automatable. If that's even a word, I don't know, uh, automated would be the way I'm looking for but you could technically make it automated. And this would be done simply by ma running a macro sequence. And with a macro sequence, you could actually t have it timed out and, you know, basically plant your wall and your stairs so that you can just run right up your, you know, and make a quick advance like that. On console, you would have to use Builder Pro, and your fingers would have to be mo moving a million miles a minute, and you would have to double-click things, and it's it, it is awkward because you have to do two clicks on the same button. Whereas on PC, you can kind of just hold down the mouse button in a sense, and then change in between, and you know, it's it's a little bit, but it, it can it, it almost equalizes the the building principle. So, um. That's the biggest difference, I would say, is that the, you're going to always bind your keys to be comfortable for you on a mouse and keyboard, and the controller is kind of just at the, you know, the reason of the person that made the, the entire layout. And uh, if you watch my buddy Ghost Ninja, you'll see that with Builder Pro, you can do some wildly fast building and just, you know, look like you're on PC. And with that type of stuff, it comes a whole host of new... Um, basically community openings because 
with the cross platform as it is now it's kind of sketchy it's it's really you can either get put in a, a match that's all mixed players or you can get put in a match that's all pc players and uh yeah you're not going to get pc players against ps4 players unfortunately like that really often and um i don't know what the, it's it's just you know really xbox and ps4 need to come to an agreement and just let true cross-platform happen and this will be so much better and then we can really just show that uh you know all of the community should play together as is and then you know we'll see what's up um but that's my that's you know only me and my thoughts on this entire idea guys you know i really do think that the cross-platform play has become uh something that's going to be absolute in the few in, within the next few years for every multiplayer game especially shooters and i believe that most of us like this and i don't really think that you or me is going to buy a console uh anymore anyways unless we want it whereas before like when playstation 4 came out and xbox one came out everybody was kind of getting what their friends had and that's not conducive to great play right now so you know I think that if I wanted a PlayStation 4, I should be able to buy a PlayStation 4 and play with my Xbox friends. I don't think that uh, the greed that, you know, is enforcing that everyone has to play on the same console should exist. But it does, you know, nonetheless, it does, it does. And, uh, you know, that's my two cents on it. But, guys, I absolutely decimated Dr. Lupo. And if you would like to get on the giveaway, go ahead and like this video, subscribe, and hit that link in the description so that you are absolutely entered and you can see what new options i add for more entries as time goes by thanks for watching the video guys i'm going to leave you here with the rest of this w but that i got for uh patch 4.0 and uh, if you really like this video go ahead and share it with somebody but thank you for watching